Hello everyone, welcome back. In this lecture, we will discuss about project architecture. We will use the following architecture to develop the project. First, we will start with images. In this module, we will collect the images from different sources. Then, we will label each and every image of the vehicle manually. This process is time taken and very important step. The whole process is depend on this module. Then we will do data pre-processing like normalization, transformation, etc. With the clean data, we will train an image with powerful deep learning model for the object detection. That is for detecting or recognizing number plate. Once a model gets trained, we will store the model in frozen format. This whole process comes under labeling and training phase. In the next step, we will work on production our deep learning model. Here, we will take a validation data or data we want to test. We will apply the same data pre-processing technique that was applied to the data while in the training phase. In order to get the object action for number plate of vehicles, we will restore the model that was saved and pass the image to the restored model. Now this model will return the object action or position of number plate, which is also known as region of interest, ROI. With this, we complete the module two of the project and get the number plate from the image. Now we will start working on module 3. In module 3, we will send the region of interest image to OCR, aka optical character recognition, and return the text from the image. Here, we are using the Google Tesser app to do that, which is absolutely free. Now, finally, we will pipeline the entire model, which is our end of the module 3. In the module 4, we will start present the project by creating a web application in Flask. Where the idea is user uploads a vehicle image from the front end and the back end or the server side model process it and returns the vehicle number. With this, your project is ready. So this is the architecture we are going to follow to build the entire project. In the next lecture, we will talk more about this project. Thank you very much.